local company secures a huge financial backing from a regional-based entity to construct and improve new roads and corridors on a bustling family island. Desmond Saunders tells us more. We are very pleased with the deal that we have with, with, with Cygnus and we are in discussions with them to look at securing more, more deals for the future. President of Bahamas Striping Group of Companies, Atario Mitchell, sees a historic deal as a win-win for his company, the Bahamas government, and Exuma. This now that they have secured $25 million from Jamaica-based Cygnus Credit Investments Limited to complete the massive road improvement project for Exuma. Bahamas Striping's managing director, Alan Albury, says... The new deal speaks to the company's vibrancy in the business market. In this instance, we went with the international company because of the terms, the flexibility, and as the president alluded to, um, they did not sort of put a noose around us in terms of the stringent requirements, albeit there are requirements that have to be met. The greater challenges that small and medium-sized businesses have always had in the Bahamas is access to capital. And uh, there are institutions um, uh, that have uh, cash laden locally, um, but they don't take the risk on entrepreneurial spirit or the Bahamian drive. The $60 million improvement project includes street signage, guardrail and work drainage installations, sidewalk repairs and verge cleaning. The project is a public-private partnership between the Bahamas Striping Caribbean Pavement Solutions and the government. It transfers risk and rewards to private sector partners who choose to collaborate with the government to design, finance, and build crucial public infrastructure with private capital as opposed to funds from the public purse. The key elements of this 3P is uh, the level of um, not just the employment, but the empowerment. Um, and so naturally, naturally, there are scores of persons that are employed on the project directly. Um, but beyond that, um, we've earmarked uh, in excess of $10, $10 million that will trickle down into local contracts or contracts for local service providers. As construction moves forward, more funding will be acquired. Mitchell is hopeful that the project will be completed on time and within budget. End result is Exuma is going to have 45 miles of, of asphalt paved roads. That's uh, the main highway as well as some side roads. Uh, what we are pushing to do now is we, are, we have a schedule before we close for the, for the Christmas. We are pushing to have 12 miles of, of, of road paved within this new uh, 3P project. The multi-million dollar project is set for completion 2024. Desmond Saunders, The Bahamas Tonight.